सिद्धांत सरस्वती विजयते गौरी गोष्ठी पति वंदे गुरुपद द्वंद भक्त बिंद समित श्रीचैतन्य प्रभु वंदे निंदोदित श्री नंद नंदन वंदे राधिका चरणोदय गोपीजन सयुक्त बिंदवनम मनोहर वाछाकुर्वश कृपा सिंधु बवच पतितान पावनेभ्यो वैष्णवेभ्यो नमो नम मुकोति वाचाल पंगुंगल हैतगिरी यत्की पातम हंग वंदे परमाधव बृंदावै तुलसीदेव पिया वै केशव सच स्नभक्तिपदेवी सत्वत् नमो नम नारायण नमस्कृत नरुंच नरोत्तम देवी सरस्वती व्यास तथो जयो मुदीर संकर्तने कृष्ण कथोपदेश गौरीयपत्र प्रकाशने सदाक्त गुरुभक्ति भक्ति प्रमोदाक्ष जगोदरुण ध्येय सदा परीभवग्नमीष्टदोहम तीर्थास्पदम शिव विरचन तम शरण्यम भीतात्म पुनतपाल भवादीपूत वंदे महापुरुष ते चरुणारविंद यत्दपल्लवन खचंद मनीछटा विस्फुजीत गुशुदर्शी पूर्णागरसागर सारूर्ति साराधि कामयि कदा कृपा कौशि श्रीकृष्णचैतन्य प्रभुनेतानंद श्रीअद्वैतगदाधर शिवसदी गौरभक्तबिंद श्रीकृष्णचैतन्य प्रभुनेतानंद श्रीअद्वैतगदाधर शिवसदी गौरभक्तबिंद हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे आजानुलम्बित भुजो कनुका बुदा तो संकीर्तन कपितरो कमलायताक्ष विशाबरो दिजबरो जुगधर्म पालो वंदे जगत प्रिय करो करुणा भतारो हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे नमामि गंगे तब पाद पंकज सुरासुरबंदी दिव्यूप भुक्ति मुक्ति दासी नित्यम भावान्ेण सदा नरा गंगा तरंगरमणीयटाकलापम गौरी निरंतर विभूषित बाम भाग नारायण प्रिय मनोंगमदापहारम वाराणसीपुरपति भज विश्वनाथ वागीशजुस्व बदने लक्ष्मीजस्व चक्षसी यस्ते हृदय संवीत निशिंगमहम भजे हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे विजित ऋषिक वायु विरादान्त मुनो स्तुरगम 
ಚೈಯತಂತಿಯಂತುಮತಿಲೋಲೋಮುಪಾಯುಖಿದ ವ್ಯಸನ ಸತಾಮೃತ ಸಮವಹಾಯ ಗುರುಶರನ ಬನಿಯೈವಾಜ ಸಂತಕೃತಕರ್ಣೋದರಾಜಲೋಧು ಬಿಜಿತ ಋಷಿಕವಾಯು ವಿರದಂತ ಮುನಸ್ತುರಗಂ ಜೈಯತಂತಿಯಂತುಮತಿಲೋಲೋಮುಪಾಯುಖಿದ ವ್ಯಸನ ಸತಾಮೃತ ಸಮವಹಾಯ ಗುರುಶರಣ ಬನಿಜೈವಾಜ ಸಂತಕೃತಕರ್ಣಧರ ಜಲಧೌ ಗೌರಿಯ ಗೋಷ್ಠೀಪತಿ ಶ್ರೀಶಿಲ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಸಿದ್ಧಾಂತ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ಗೋಸ್ವಾಮಿ ಡಾಕ್ಟರ್ ಪ್ರಭುಪಾ ಪರಮಂಶು ಜಗದ್ಗುರು ಸೇಟ್ ದೇ ಆಕರ್ ಗುರು ತತ್ವ ಬಲ್ಲಾವಜಿ ಮಹಾರಾಜ್ ಕಾಮಿಂಗ್ ಡೌನ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಫಾರ್ಮ್ ಆಫ್ ಗುರು ವೈಷ್ಣವ್ ಟು ಡೆಲಿವರ್ ಆಲ್ ಬಾಂಡೆಡ್ ಸೋಲ್ ಗೌರಿಯ ಗೋಷ್ಠೀಪತಿ ಶ್ರೀಶಿಲ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಸಿದ್ಧಾಂತ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ಗೋಸ್ವಾಮಿ ಡಾಕ್ಟರ್ ಪ್ರಭುಪಾ ಪರಮಂಶು ಜಗದ್ಗುರು ಸೇರ್ ದೇ ಆಕರ್ ಗುರು ತತ್ವ ಬಲ್ಲಾವಜಿ ಮಹಾರಾಜ್ ಈಸ್ ಕಾಮಿಂಗ್ ಡೌನ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಫಾರ್ಮ್ ಆಫ್ different guru vaishnav to deliver us to deliver us they are traveling all around this way guru tattva vaishnav tattva is same with bhagavat tattva or i can say little bit more than bhagavat tattva acharya mam bijaniya nava mannet karhi chit ನ ಮರ್ತ ಬುದ್ಧ ಅಸೇತ ಸರ್ವದೇವ ಮಯೋ ಗುರು ಆಚಾರ್ಯ ಮಾಂಗ್ ಬಿಜಾನಿ ನೋ ಇಟ್ ಫಾರ್ ಶಿಯೋರ್ ಭಗವಾನ್ ಸ್ಪೀಕಿಂಗ್ ನೋ ಇಟ್ ಫಾರ್ ಶಿಯೋರ್ ಐ ಆಮ್ ಆಚಾರ್ಯ ಐ ಆಮ್ ಕಮಿಂಗ್ ಡೌನ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಫಾರ್ಮ್ ಆಫ್ ಸದ್ಗುರು ವೈಷ್ಣವ್ ಟು ಡೆಲಿವರ್ ಆಲ್ ಬಾಂಡೆಡ್ ಸೋಲ್ ವೆರ್ ಎವರ್ ಪೀಪಲ್ ದೇ ಆರ್ ಇನ್ ಪೇನ್ಫುಲ್ ಸಿಚುವೇಶನ್ ವಿತ್ ಮ್ಯಾಟರ್ 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 ದೇ ನೋ ದೇ ನೋ ನಥಿಂಗ್ ಎಕ್ಸೆಪ್ಟ್ ಮ್ಯಾಟರ್ they know nothing those material people they have nothing no conception except matter there can be something even scientists they are bound to say that matter is there antimatter must be there but we cannot speak clearly because day is there night is there good is there bad is there synonym antony so matter is there all around matter so antimatter must be there which we we can guess but we cannot speak clearly antimatter antimatter means chinmoy antimatter means chinmoy so people are busy with matter all the time they have no idea about how to go out of this trap of maya all around illusory energy all around you it is next to impossible for you to go out of this maya is true but there is way there is way we can go out of maya by guru vaishnav seva we can go out of maya the shloka i started with as the shlok speaking from bhagavatam ಬಿಜಿತ ಋಷಿಕ ವಾಯು ವಿರದಂತ ಮುನಸ್ತರಗಂ ಜಯಂತಿ ಯಂತುಮತಿ ಲೋಲಮ್ಮ ಪಾಯ್ ಉಪಾಯ ಖಿದು ವೈನ್ ಎವರ್ ಸಂಬೋರಿ ಟ್ರೈ ಟು ಗೆಟ್ ಕಂಟ್ರೋಲ್ ಓವರ್ ಇಸ್ ಸೆನ್ಸ್ ಆರ್ಗನ್ ಎವ್ರಿಥಿಂಗ್ ಹಿ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಟ್ರೈ ಟು ಕಟ್ ಮಾಯ ಬಟ್ ಹಿ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ನಾಟ್ ಕಟ್ ಮಾಯ ಬೈ ಪರ್ಸನಲ್ ಎಫರ್ಟ್ ಬಿಜಿತ ಋಷಿಕ ವಾಯು ವಿರದಂತ ಮುನಸ್ತರಗಂ like a mad horse like a crazy horse can never be under control if you try to ride that mad horse it can jump and throw you and kick you and you can die you can die we have seen the mountain police mountain police in uh, football ground here there they can to control the crazy you know public this way by your personal effort only we can only we can become failure we cannot come out successful 
in this Bhagavatam sloka, it is written, our body, what we have at present, that can be compared with a boat. Many times, in Bhagavatam also it can come. Nideha madhyam sulabam sudurlabam plabam sukal, sukalpam guru dharam All, everything sloka there. This sloka also. Suppose you, you try to imagine, you try to imagine that you are in a boat. Suppose you imagine you are in a boat in a big ocean. You cannot see where, where we can go. You cannot see. You can remember that you are in a boat and the boat is there in a big ocean, specific ocean or Atlantic Ocean, whatever. Imagine. It is true. One man from which country, I don't know, Malaysia or what country, I don't know, if I forget. He came back from the ocean after 14 months. He was in the ocean. He was lost. By the wind, he was lost. Alone. How he lived, I don't know. This way, you can find endless water all around. Water and water. Where to go? Endless. In that case, if there is any storm, there's big turbulent. Then your boat is now going to capsize. Now dancing. How you can live? How you can save yourself? This is the condition of our life. This is the exact condition of our life. We are in the... We are anyway. We are in a big problem. But we cannot realize. Like one small baby playing in the, in the lap of mother. There is all around fighting going on. I mean, a soldier coming, fight. But the boy, small boy, in the, uh, playing. A small boy, no? or whole, you know, their village, everything inundated. I mean, flood coming, current, barrage, water barrage break, and going to take away everything. But still, the small boy, baby in the mother lap, playing. No idea. What is the problem? No idea. That is our condition. We are in big problem all around Maya. All around. Nobody can put challenge that I can go out of Maya. Nobody can. Up to now, nobody. In that case, how we can save ourselves? That is the main problem. How we can save ourselves? All around Maya. All problem in Upanishad it is written. In Upanishad it is written. Written for us all, bonded soul. Uttishtato jagrato prapo barano nibodhato kurosho dhara nishitaya durgam patastat kavayo vadanti. Big big rishi munis, all exalted devotees, they are speaking. They are speaking, why you are sleeping? Why you are sleeping? Get up! You cannot see that benediction, everything waiting for you. Why not to get up? We get back your consciousness level, you try to increase and get blessings from Guru Vaishnava, all Dibba Suris previously, all. All of our Rishi Munis, they are keeping all. Amrita, treasure for you. But why you are going to drink poison? Why you are going to drink poison to kill yourself? Why? That's why Upanishad speaking, our material life, our material lifestyle, what we are leading, it is just like an innocent, ignorant boy try to run over a knife, razor, razor, you know, razor, Saving, we are running over a razor. We are running over a razor. Very sharp razor. We are trying to walk. Is it possible to run over? Sir? But we are trying. Upanishad speaking, we are actually those material people. They like to enjoy their life. I know it's quite natural. 
But point is that they are just trying to o walk over a sharp razor. So anyway, they are going to cut their leg and everything finish. But they cannot run. Uttishtato jagrato prapa varano nivodhato khurasya dhara nishitaya durgam patastat kavaya vadanti. This material life is so dangerous. Those who are Dibbo Suri, those who are Paramahansa Guru Vaishnava, they can walk. What they are doing? What they are doing? They are playing with fire. They are just playing with fire. Different kind of desire. Fire going on inside. Fire of desire. How to quench heart? How to quench your heart? No way. Nobody can help. Father, mother, wife, children. Who can save you? Nobody can. Such many cases I know. Such many in, in, in my small life, it also happened. In Siliguri, North Bengal, I was speaking Harikatha. Many times I went there, three, four times, three times minimum. One day I was speaking Harikatha. I started Harikatha. I went there and I so many audience there because public coming there. So every day I am watching one girl shrugging his head, bent and hearing Harikatha. A painful heart. I notice all all public I'm watching sometime. When the whole Bhagavad Katha is over, analytical discussion, not possible still. It was analytical. But two times. Morning time two hours, evening time two, four hours continuously. Harikatha going on. In the meantime, when the Harikatha is over, last day, I am going to leave next day. Then the father of that girl coming to me and speaking, Maharaj, you have done a great, you know, kipa. You have given a great kipa. And why? But my, my girl was supposed to make suicide because she wanted to marry one man. But she died, accident. But after hearing Harikatha, she get back his life. He can, she can understand the meaning of life now. This way many such incidents happen even in my life. So, people out of their ignorance can jump into fire. But mother and father, mother, small baby, going to put hand into fire. But mother can catch. I know one boy in my look, in all, mother cutting sabji, going for some other seva, a small boy coming, and catching, catching the knife this way. All, all cut. Oh, blood and blood. Because small baby, no idea, innocent baby. This way, we are ignorant, we are innocent, but Guru Vaishnava cannot be here. Anyhow, they are going to give all their blood and energy, somehow to deliver, somehow to deliver. But still, we are not going to pay attention to their, what kind of honest effort they are doing. We think them, they are enemy. Because they are speaking this way, surely they are enemy. Not speaking sweetly, so he is enemy. Who is going to attend his harikatha? He is speaking this way, really so. Mayadavi cannot allow you to attend harikatha, actual harikatha. So whom to blame? Mayadavi cannot allow you. You can go on rolling down his material life this way. So this way, if you discover yourself Torrential rain, all, you know, big storm, all around. You are helpless. The boat is, you know, these, these are going. Where you are at present, you have no idea. In that case, what you can do? Many such Bhagavatam, in Bhagavatam itself, so many slogan. Our Gurudev is the boatman or the crew. Gurudev can be compared with crew. Crew means who is running the boat. I mean the steamer or ship, whatever. Crewman is going to check up which direction the boat, I mean, going. 
with compass, everything according to that going. This way, we have no other support because Bhagavan cannot come down. Bhagavan cannot come down directly to help us. Gauranga Mahapu came, okay, a special case. Otherwise, usually Bhagavan not coming. Usually Bhagavan sending his representative. They are going to manage the situation somehow. Very rare case, Bhagavan coming down. This way, if you are successful to get control over your sense organ, because many yogi, many gyani, for the time being, they prove that they are successful. For the time being. Some yogi, sometime can prove we are out of, no problem. Sometime they can prove. But the yogi also become in trouble again. When Maya comes, so many, so many examples there in Bhagavatam. They are doing yoga everything, but the yoga broken. Maya is so. Even Sankar Bhagavan cannot put challenge against Maya. We have never seen. So, Guru Karana Dharam. Guru going to control you. Provided you are going to sell your head unto the lotus feet of Guru. If you are not going to sell your head unto the lotus feet of Guru Bhattvatma, then Guru has nothing to do. Whatever Guru, maybe Prabhupada, Bhakti, Mithyaguru, many such fall down. You need one Sadguru powerful who has direct connection with Bhagavan. Vaikuntha Jagat, directly. He has direct connection with Vaikuntha Jagat. He has directly connection with Vaikuntha Jagat, taking Badha Jeev, taking the hair like a one man or woman going to die in water. She has no idea about how to swim. She is going to drown. One man knowing nice swimming, what she can do? What he can do? He can go and catch the hair. Because going to catch the body, then the lady or that man can grab you. And both of them can go. So the man going to watch here, going to catch the hair. And pull. Pull here, one hand swimming, and after then pull and set. This is the case. So when a man is going to drown, then this way, those who are going to deliver those men, sometimes speedboat there, speedboat, in different pilgrimage, they are ready. If any lady or a man is going to die, so going and catching you. Yeah. But they are getting hair. This way, Guru Vaishnava, they are always ready. Like a rescue man. Rescue man, you know? Rescue man, always ready. Fire brigade man ready, always alert, how to save. This way, rescue man always ready to rescue. This way. Guru Vaishnava, they are the deputed personalities of Bhagavan. That's why. So, like mad elephant, our mind can never come under all control. This expectation is one kind of illusion. Our mind can never come under our control is a, is a proven fact. It is proven. Our mind can never come. It is crazy. Cannot come. So there is some procedure by the help of which we can come out successful. There is procedure. So in Shastra it is written, if we are going to sell our head unto a lotus feet of Guru Vaishnava, then and only then they are possible. If you are going to preserve your head, then no possibility. All your material brain, material idea, material mind are going to put you in great trouble. No solution can. So to get success, we'll have to sell. But it is impossible. To sell our head unto the lotus feet of Prabhupada and Guru Bhargava. But those who are successful, they can get power, such a power, like Haridas Thakur. You know? Haridas Thakur is great exalt. Hai. In Namacharjo, I am with the topmost title given to Haridas. Because Nam is the almost 
Nam is the topmost, and he is the Acharya of Nam. That Harida Sakur going to deliver the prostitute, going to deliver him. After that, after that, what happened? Harida Sakur waiting for three days to deliver that lady. Otherwise, there, otherwise there was no question. Harida Sakur was supposed to go away. Harida Sakur was speaking, I am just waiting three days to deliver it. I know that what what is the what kind of plotting going against me unnecessarily. So I know the case. But I am waiting for you. But the lady was delivered by Haridas Thakur. Anyway, not only delivered, not only delivered. Finally, she was the jewel, not not jewel. I am the touch stone. Not that touch stone going to touch iron. Not that touch stone going to touch any iron, and that iron piece can be can get converted into gold, but not that case. Haridas Thakur himself a touch stone and he is going to make that lady touch stone. Can you imagine? So, now you imagine, now you try to imagine what is the case. Haridas Thakur going to deliver a fallen lady. So fallen, so fallen, cannot imagine. Going to deliver that lady. She become a great devotee. Such a great devotee in Chaitanya Bhagavad Gita written, all big, big Acharyas going to take darshan of that lady and pay pranam. How possible? How possible? So it is possible. It is possible. But we will have to sell our head unto a lotus feet of Guru Vaishnava, Shuddha Guru Vaishnava. Then and only then we can. Yesterday I was speaking about Shabde Paricha Nishnatam Brahmani Uposamasrayam. In this respect, I wanted to explain something one day before. Shabde Paricha Nishnatam Brahmani Uposamasrayam. Shabda Brahma Parabrahma, if my Guru Padma, luckily, my Guru Padma is. Very verse in Sabda Brahma and Parabrahma, both he has idea. Because Prabhupada allowed him to do Bani Seva, that he also wanted to give me Bani Seva. So I'm lucky. So Sabdi Parichanisnatam, Sabda Brahma, he should be verse with direct realization. Sabda Brahma, he is going to realize what is Sabda Brahma directly. Not that only memorize. Somebody can have their memory, very nice memory. He can memorize, so not that. He is a realized soul. All Shastra, everything, he realizes everything. And he has his capacity to, uh, to inculcate or to you know, transfer all his archer and everything to any fallen soul, provided he is inclined. He can do it. Shabde pare brahm, shabde, shabdo brahman parabrahm, shabdo pare, shabde pare chanisnatam. Parabrahma mean, parabrahma mean, parabrahma mean direct Bhagavan. He has his direct realization about the direct seva of Bhagavan. Direct seva of Bhagavan. So he has his full realization about Shabda Brahma. And about Parabrahma also, she has direct realization of Seva. Seva Ananda. Ananda of Seva. Why devotee can do so much Seva? Big, big result to do. They never feel tired. Why? Because they are getting enjoyment. Because they are getting enjoyment in it. So if you are going to get enjoyment in the Seva, then no question of tiredness. When you feel disgusted, then from your brain, some negative hormone can come out and make you sleepy. I don't like to see. I am tired. This way, tiredness develops inside us. One kind of negative, toxic thing and make our body feel 
lethargy. I don't like this so much. So much. But a sportsman playing, giving energy eight hours, ten hours. Those are big, big players. They are not feeling tired. This is their enjoyment. So, Shabde Parichan Isnatam Min, Shabda Brahma is having clear idea, right, with realization. Shabda, I mean Shastra. And Parabrahma Min, he has his direct Sevananda, experience of experience of seva ananda seva ananda that is, that's why he can help you those who are having no seva ananda only ba 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 speaking philosophy they cannot help shabdo brahma parabrahma so i was explain, explaining that what about loknath goswami loknath goswami not going to speak Harikatha directly, but he has his direct realization of Seva. Bhagavan manifested himself with Simati Radharani. Gave him Seva. Total, total in his kinchan, staying under a tree. And Radha and uh, I mean, not Govindo, some name I forgot, I used to go there. He used to keep in the Bag, I and mean, bagwin one jola with cloth make knot and jola. No temple, nothing. He used to take out of jola, do seva. After that again seva as well, prasadam everything. After putting here and going here. Lokna Goswami going to send Narutam Thakur to learn from Jiva Goswami. There is no jealousy. Gopal Bhattu Goswami is going to send Srinivas Acharya to, to go and learn from Jiva Goswami Pad. This way, Samananda Bhubu also sent by his Gurudev. So there was no jealousy. By actors and jealousy. Why you are going to attend this? Area? What happens? What problem in you? Why you are going? Like a dictator, like Hitler. Hey, don't go there. Don't here. Don't there. What is this? You are a dictator? You like to become a Hitler? You are passing comment, but you yourself cannot give any answer to your comment. You are getting dictation. If I ask why, you cannot give answer. You cannot give answer, proper answer. The only answer is that you are in jealousy. Why? What problem? What problem is it? Is going to attend Harikatha. Okay, in our society, so many young, young batches can come up, they can fill the society. It's very good. But in future, we are going to leave this world. Somebody has to take control. I mean, control means not. They can know, they can speak Harikatha, they can come up. I mean, through parampara, we like, through exact Sautapantha parampara, we like to keep the lamp glowing. We don't like to see the lamp is already extinguished. All different world. In your country, you can glow, you can help to glow the lamp. Not any mentally concocted idea. All same exactly. If you are going to make something superficial, you can get punishment for that. Exactly. Try to protect the parampara. Try to protect the parampara. Forget the interest of your society. Forget, try to forget the interest of your society. It's my apple unto a lotus feet. All, everybody. You try to forget. Come out of this bondage. This one kind of bondage. Ignorant. Try to come out of them. We have to give overall protection of our society. So that in future also new generations who are coming, they can get the lamps intact way glowing. We'll have to put oil, Harikatha. This is the condition. But I don't know why they, be, they like to become a hooligan, they like to become a, you know, what you call boss, dictator. They like to prove. Mafia, mafio. Educational mafia there, sports mafia there, 
Follow. Everywhere. Mafia there. Political mafia there. Also, in our bhajan line, mafia there. They only to capture all money, position like Ravan. Who can put challenge against them? They can kill you. If you go against them, they kill you. They are mafia. Clearly. Come on, clearly. It is very clear. By watching their activities, it is very clear. Foolish people, they cannot understand. They can run and they can die there. Anyway, so I was discussing so many things, but one thing I like to discuss, main thing, that I told, if I like to serve other pure Guru Vaishnava, is it prohibited for me? You can ask one Vaishnava. <coughs> if I like to serve one pure Guru Vaishnava, is it prohibited for me? Yes. Prohibited? No. Who told prohibited? Who told? I used to send to Tithya Goswami Maharaj, you know, Sagar Maharaj, all, all devotees, they come in to take initiation. No, 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 no. I am less interested to give initiation. You go to Tithya Maharaj, Sagar Maharaj, you go there, Vaishnava, Bhaman Goswami Maharaj, you go there, great Vaishnava, you go there. No, 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 no. You go there. No, I like to, no, I have nothing. Santu Maharaj. Even they like to take sannyasa based from me. You can go them. Okay, I can do jagya for you. I can see that I can help, but you can go. Too. I am not qualified. So I never feel any jealousy. I never feel why. You point out one pure devotee. I can send you go, go and serve him. It's good. Jealousy should not come inside. Now at present this. Is. I don't know why. Very cheap politics going on. Very sorry to see the situation. So yesterday I was speaking the Siddhanto. Yesterday I was speaking the Siddhanto of, of whom? Jiva Goswami Pad. Jiva Goswami writing that by taking the permission of Guru Pad Padma, or if Gurudev already gone, what is the procedure? Guru Bhagaya, Tat Sevan, Tat Sevan, Avrodhinacha, Annesham Opi Vaishnavanam Sevanam Sra. In Bhakti Sandarva, Jiva Goswami was writing that Guru Bhagaya, if Gurudev is in physically present, you can take permission. Gurudev, you give permission, I can go. Like Bhakti Vallabh Tithu Goswami, I am in Vaisasan. Bhakti Vallabh Tithu so. Great devotee. He used to, some foreign devotees asking, a Sam Baba climbing uh, here in, uh, no, not, Baba, Baba only, Sam Baba not speaking. Baba coming in Delhi mod uh, for publication job there. We can go to him to ask some question because you have no time. Titama said, who Baba? Sam Baba. Sure, you go. Those devotees are there, Slovenia, here, there. They have the document. Yes, you can go. He never said, don't go to Sam Baba. Then, he huh? so, used to send me to airport to accept all new, new devotees. I accept them like my children. I, with loveful mood, sit, make them sit in car and all the way, diver, diving, I am speaking Harikatha. To mold them so that they can take shelter of Bhakti Vala Not on the to speed up. They forget this case. They forget, but Tithu Goswami never forget. Maharaj giving means, I am not going to make some politics. So I speak Harikatha and can give some money from them and I can say, you take shelter of me. I never do. I come back and give them offer as a flower until Maharaj, here you are. Then, Maharaj never felt that if I send Samal Krishna or my neighbors or Baba, Baba, he can make some manipulation. They have their eyes. Sila Tithu Goswami can see my heart. What is there inside? I cannot cheat him. So, many times he wanted to test me. He told me, Maharaj, you stay in our mat. And uh, your Guru Padma was the editor. I can, Maharaj, 
I am, I am very much interested to do seva with you. But you know it very well. They cannot allow me to do seva freely. They can put some pressure on me or to do this way. Then how I can do? Suppose I am going to give you some seva, Vaishnava seva, nice seva. At the same time, I am, I am going to put pressure on you to do. Then you cannot allow me to do seva freely. Big problem is that. In Kishnagar, one time in Jhulan Purnima, Harikatha going on. Inside room, I went to meet with Maharaj and talking. I say, Maharaj, you are my Guru Padma. No, I am not your Guru. You are actually my God Bhagavan. No, not God Bhagavan. After that, Maharaj said, you like to go with me to America for preaching? Maharaj, I am a fallen soul. In Vyasasana speaking, Maharaj, you can go with me to America for preaching? And Maharaj, I am a fallen soul. All around in America, a maya, maya, illusion. Illusion all around. I cannot survive. The same thing what Tittu Maharaj told to my Guru Maharaj. When Guru Maharaj said, you must go to foreign country for preaching. Maharaj, I am a fallen, I cannot. It is maya, illusion. Maharaj speaking. Oh, Maharaj, all around maya, how I can save myself? This is the humbleness there. Yeah. This way, Jiva Goswami was speaking. Jiva Goswami was speaking that, well, by taking the permission of Guru Pad Padma, you can serve pure Guru Vaishnava, those who are in line with your Guru Pad Padma. I mean, those who are going to hate your Guru Pad Padma is a big problem. So, this way we can accept and serve. But I was speaking about if that sadhu is from many times it happens so. Ramanuja sadhu, Ramanandi sadhu, Siddha Mahatma. According to their conception, their Siddha. Siddha Mahatma. I have picture. I can show you the picture of that Baba. So many things. Sometimes I meet with Siddha Baba, but from other sampradaya. But I go to learn something new. Eh? To learn something new by the instruction of Guru Vaishnava, so that I can apply, I can in my own life. They have some good also. But that, that Baba, Siddha Bhagavad Das Baba, he was from Ayodha. I was there in Ayodha, I was there in Nakki Ghat, Varanasi, his ashram there. I have seen his mood, his activities, I have seen. One man coming with, on those days, Two lakhs of rupees, one rich man coming with a carton and going to put in front of Baba, Baba sitting. Baba, Nandova, you accept it. Baba speaking, what is it? What, what is it? And the two, Baba speaking, okay, you can hand over to the in charge. Not even touching. Follow, they can spend in seva. So this way, but anyway, surely I am not going to learn anything which is against our Gaudiya Bhajan. I was very clever. Not going to accept any wrong Siddhanta. Wrong Siddhanta, according to their uh, Bhajan, they can speak Siddhanta. But that Siddhanta, uh, I have nothing to do with my Bhajan. Or sometime I can use favorable way, maybe. So, Jiva Goswami Pa writing that Guru Gaya. Tat sevan avirodhena cha, if my original, if my original Guru Seva not going to be hampered, it, if my original Guru Seva not going to be hampered this way, if my original Guru Seva not going to be hampered this way, I can serve others. Like I serve Bhakti Vala Goswami. But my original Guru Seva not going to be disturbed. What to speak about disturbance? Maharaj, allow me to stay in temple. I am getting favor. They are doing seva. Not that to serve Bhakti Vala Goswami Maharaj. I was in a tight position. Not that. I am feeling more relaxed. So this way, if I can serve Bhavan Goswami Maharaj, if I can serve Tithu Goswami Maharaj, Nayananda Baba, or many such devotees there, Giri Maharaj, Eh, Giri Maharaj, 
or uh, Bhakti Vadhan Sagar Maharaj, so many devotees. There is no problem for me. Guru Maharaj never told that don't go to serve them. No, so you can serve them. Madhav Goswami used to engage his disciple in the seva of such you know, Guru Varga. My Guru Varga is our Guru Varga. Bharati Maharaj, Titha Maharaj or other Vaishnavas, you can serve him. But he went against Titha Goswami. Uh, he went against um, Bhakti Vidya Madhav Goswami. He totally went against Bhakti Daita Madhav Goswami. But in the old age he coming in search of some shelter. Titha Maharaj, our Madhav Goswami was saying, sure, Godfather, you come, you stay. When Maharaj is going to engage one seva, seva, I cannot serve him. I cannot serve him. He is against you. He has gone against you. I, it is my order. You have to serve. You have to serve this Maharaj. He is now in old age. He has done some seva Prabhupada. So those who have done some seva Prabhupada, their lotus feet, their dust particular to go. Lucky. Whatever Guru Varga is, I cannot speak this way. This is very prejudicial idea, very narrow conception. This conception, if coming, then I can get deviated from the track of Bhagavad Dharma. Even I cannot stay in Bhagavad Dharma. What to speak about Acharya and uh, World Fisha? Even I cannot stay in the track of Bhagavad Dharma. I totally can get scattered. Nobody thinking. Now false philosophy going in testful, testful false philosophy going on, so that you can feel more practical, more enjoyment. You are less interested for the absolute truth. You are less. I know. You are coming to get something else. I am hundred percent sure. You are coming in bhajan to get something else, not that absolute truth. Hundred percent, I can touch Bhagavatam and speak. You have come to get some love, puja, patishtha, mani, position, this. Not to get Bhagavan. The symptom can speak. Like the doctor can touch your pulse and can say. So I can say. Love, puja, patishtha. In search of that absolute truth, if at all I am coming out of home, leaving everything in search of that absolute truth, then why I am going this way, wrong way? Why? Krishna nation. Gopika speaking, we are searching Krishna in forest, everywhere. Twam bichin bate. We are searching you all for where is Krishna gone? Even general truth. I have evidence. If you like to say, I can so, but I don't like to insult them. Let them stay there. They are speaking totally lie. What to speak about the absolute truth? I am not going to touch absolute truth. I am not going to touch absolute truth for the time being. Even they are not going to touch general truth. General truth, as you know, material truth. Oh, you, material truth, even they are not going to touch it. They are going to speak false. Just for some money, some position. So many documents you have, I have. But I don't like to show. Because it is not my intention to insult them. But that Harikatha, if they are feeling insulted, I am sorry. I beg for pardon and to lotus feet. I am bound to speak what Papa told. I am bound to speak Guru Bargo. I cannot obey you. Excuse me. You are also my Shiksha Guru, because you are jumping into fire and going to teach me that I am burning, you see. So you, you keep yourself, you try to protect yourself. So you are not my enemy. You can think me enemy. I'm, I never think you are my enemy. Never I like to insult you to prove that you are fallen. Okay. It is the arrangement of Bhagavan. I am not going to expose those. I have no need. So anyway, Jiva Goswami was writing, that Guru Gaya Tat Sevan Avirodena Cha Anne Sam Ophi 
Annesham Upi Vaishnavanam Sevanam Sreho. If you are going to serve other Vaishnavas by taking the permission of Guru Pad Padma, pure Paramahansa Guru Vaishnava is very good. It will be even give you backing. Because Guru Tattva, Guru Tattva, I can show you, Guru Pad Padma writing, that Guru Tattva means if I love Prabhupada, if I love Prabhupada, I will have to love all genuine devotees of Prabhupada. Those who serve. That was the darshan of Madhu Goswami. You will have to serve him. Oh, he gone against you. Okay, whatever. My instruction, you will have to serve him. You have to serve him. But he is bound to serve. Even gone against. Follow. Many such incidents I can speak. One Baba, Parama, Baba Ji Maharaj. He came, Gurudas Baba, like, no Gurudas Baba. Another Baba, I forget. Many uh, such Babas are there who took base from Prabhupada. One day he is coming to temple by the desire of Madhu Goswami. He is staying in the Mayapur temple. Mayapur temple. But he was against Madhu Goswami previously. So the Sevak is a little bit negative. He is serving by the, by the order of Gurudev. He is serving, but a little bit negative inside. Oh, it's done, gone against my Guru Pad. So what happens? One day, due to some reason, the Sevak speaking all rubbish to Baba, Paramahansa, Baba Ji Maharaj. You have done this, you have done this, this way. After that, what happened? He closed the door and staying without water and prasadam. He closed all door and windows. And going to stay inside room and crying, fasting, for one day gone already. In the meantime, by chance, Bhakti Vita Madhu Goswami is reaching this temple and uh, everybody paying pranam to Bhakti Vita Madhu Goswami is Hattata asking, where Baba, Baba Ji Maharaj, where gone? Ah, Baba Ji Maharaj, inside temple, inside room, for two days. Eh? Inside room for two days, mean? What do you mean? He's not taking water, prasad. Eh? Why? But that, that Shevak spoke all rubbish to him. Oh, really? Immediately with the bag and baggages throwing and going to the gate and knocking, Babaji Maharaj, open the door, please open the door, please open. My children is also your children. If he is ignorant, he has done something wrong, done something wrong, Please excuse. Please excuse. I beg for pardon. Then Baba opened the door and both of them embrace each other, crying. That was the heart of Bhakti Vita Madhugosi. In the Bhajan Kutir, you have seen the Bhajan Kutir of Madhugosi Maharaj in his temple. In his temple here, Mayapur, Bhajan Kutir of Bhakti Vita Madhugosi. Srila Swami Maharaj was allowed to stay there in his bhajan room. He can stay in my room, in my room, to take, check up the construction. You don't know. Old history, you don't know. You are allowed. No, it's my Godmother. You can stay here. In, my, in your temple, yes. In my room, you can stay. In my room. You can give same honor like me. These are teachings of our Guru Bhargava. And now negative teaching prevail. How I can be here? If you think it is my enmity, okay, Bhagavan can give judgment against me. But Bhagavan and Guru Vaishnava understand my heart. I never want to go against anybody. But I will have to establish the absolute truth. For this reason, if I need to speak some heart, I am bound to speak. I cannot allow that absolute truth to get lost. I must give protection up to my last bob, blood drop. Last blood drop, you can try. So, this is a Siddhanta Bhisha. So, this way, if you are going to serve one Vaishnavas by taking the permission, it cannot hamper your bhajan. It can give you backing. But one point I told, like the example I told, suppose I am going to meet with some sadhu, not from Gauriya Sampada. Like I saw Siddha Mahatma, he used to give me cloth, Pranami, he is Acharya, Siddha Mahatma. He used to give, Baba, you take, no, 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 how I can't? No, you take, it is honor, just. 
Brajamandal Parikrama I used to do, I used to stay in one very small temple, one Nimbarka Sadhu. See, Nimbarka Sadhu, one devotee, Uddhav is document. That, that year particularly he was with me. One Nimbarko Sadhu, Acharya of the small temple. When I go there, he watch at me, asking, he is going to clean his own room. Own room. Oh, Baba, you stay here. You stay here. I wonder, I am an outsider. You don't know me. Even who am I? Maybe I am a dog or a thief. <laughs> who knows? He is going, no. He clean his own room. Ah, oh, Baba, you stay. Maharaj, I cannot stay inside you. Because... You are Acharya of the I can stay behind that. No, 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 you can stay. I cannot stay. I cannot stay. After that, while going, he's going to give me pranam. And Maharaj, I'm coming here, taking rest here. I need to give some pranam to you. No, no, it is the rules. Vaishnavas, they should be given. They should be given something. No? This way. So, even other sampradaya sadhu, I have seen very nice, nice sadhu. But surely I am not going to learn anything about Gauriya Bhajan. So, Rupa Goswami Bhad wanted to suggest Sajati Rasvaya Snigdhe Sadhu Sango Sato Vare. Better you can get the association of such a sadhu from your own sampradaya who is elevated than you. More practical. Then you can learn so many things about your Bhajan. If you are going to. If you are going to get the association of pure sadhu from other sampradaya, it's okay. But you cannot learn anything about your own bhajan. But you need to learn from your own bhajan. You cannot learn. That's why Rupa Goswami was writing that Sajati Rasvaya Snigide Sadhu Sangu Sato Vare. Sajati Rasvaya means from your own sampradaya, having almost similar. Baba, almost similar. No, similar, not possible, almost. Okay. Follow. Elevated than you. If you can serve him, he can go on speaking all Siddhanta Bishar, everything. And in course of serving Guru Path Padma Vaishnavas, you can learn of Siddhanta. Because this is the condition of Bhagavan Sri Krishna in Gita. In Gita, it is the condition. Na? What is the condition, Bhagavan Sri? If you like to become exalted devotee, tattva jnani, then Bhagavan Sikin, tatviddhi pranipateno, tatviddhi pranipateno sevaya, tatviddhi pranipat paripeshnano sevaya, tatviddhi pranipat paripeshnano sevaya, sevaya, eh, upadikshanti thi jnanam jnani nas tattva darshina. Those who are tattva jnani, elevated devotees, they can easily can transfer all their knowledge inside you. But provided you will have to surrender hundred percent, not duplicity. And you have to serving mood, serving temperament should be there. So Bhagavan speaking, Tat Biddhi, Tat Biddhi, be sure. No it for sure, Tat Biddhi, Pranipati, you know, by your complete surrender. Tat Biddhi, Pranipati, no, Paripashne, no. Self interrogation, you can put Maharaj, how I can do bhajan, Maya going to do this, you can put question. Tadbidi Panibhadi, Paribhasana Sevaya, by serving temperament. If you can run this way, I can put guarantee, because Bhagavan can never speak lie. If there, there is no serving impairment, I know very hard to serve Guru Vaishnava. To serve Bhagavan is more easy, to serve Guru Vaishnava is very hard. Really, so hard. So, Tadbiddi Panipatena Puribhasana Sevaya Upadikshan Titi Gyanam Gyanina Stattva Darshan. Those Stattva Gyani, not big, big, exalted sadhu, they can transfer all their feeling and knowledge inside you. And very shortly you can discover yourself. Elevated. Ah, you know, you have all Siddhanta. But you are coming late. You came late, very late. But still, you can discover the power coming inside you. How? Because unknowingly, Guru Vaishnava is going to transfer power inside you. They have eyes. Who is Niskapat, who want to get Kripa. You need not ask Kripa. Automatically, they are going to transfer power to you. This way they are doing. Maybe you are in America. Any country, anywhere, any part of the world. But Guru Vaishnava can transfer Kripa to you. Long away. 
thousands of kilometers you have it. But they can realize everything. From heart they can give keep up. And accordingly you can get power. So you see, so it is more practical to take shelter unto the lotus feet of such a, uh, I mean, lotus feet of such a sadhu, okay, but what I mean to say, or they should get the association of some elevated devotee from their own sampradaya, it is more practical, then they can, then your, your store of knowledge, storage of knowledge can get increased. Storage of knowledge can get increased. So you can get, but other sampradaya sadhu, you should not, uh, you should not insult them. So you should not insult them. You can hold it. You can, okay, give some, everything. But, actual sadhu sangha, you should do with one sampradayik sadhu, nice sampradayik sadhu, nice sadhu, from your own sampradaya, this way you can go very fast up this way. So, you see, yesterday I was speaking about the last sloka, which I am going to uh, draw conclusion of the 12th chapter of 11th canto. Conclusion. So, Bhagavan speaking to Uddhav, Uddhav final. Evam Guru Pasanaika Bhaktya Vidya Kutare no Sithe no Dhiraha Vibrishya Jeeva Sayam Apramattaha Sampaddo Chatmanam Atho Tejyastam Evam, Evam Mane, the way, the way I wanted to guide you. Evam Guru Pasanaika Bhaktya by developing bhakti out of Guru Seva. Evam Guru Pasanaika Bhaktya. I was speaking literal, I was speaking the literal meaning of Upasana, mean to worship. Only this. On to worship. It's okay. It's not bad. But Upasana has another meaning. What is that? In Sanskrit, Upo, Upo plus Asana. In Sanskrit, there are some rules and regulations, grammar. So many rules. You have to remember. If you make mistake, then the whole sentence useless. Whole sentence, just one mistake. Pronunciation, just you will have to uh, do little bit after. But you pronounce together, but the meaning change. Just previous sentence, previous word, you will have to pronounce that second word little bit after. But you pronounce together. The meaning change, totally over. Follow. It's very... So, Upasana is okay, not bad, Upasana means to worship, but another inner meaning there, Upasana means Upo, Upo plus Asana. I mean, you are going to put your Asana in front of Guru Pātpāda. You never like to go negative way, back way. Like we discovered already from Bhagavatam, Mayadavi was with, with sightful mood, Bending head and staying backside Bhagavan, not coming front side. It is written in Bhagavatam. Mayadavi don't like to come in front of Bhagavan, out of Saibhava. I have done so wrong thing. How I can come in front of? Mayadavi always staying backside of Bhagavan, not coming in front. Because feel shy. What I have done? Done nothing. Only punishment, jail, fighting, cut, this seva. I cannot come. It is written. Mayadavi feeling shy to come in front of Bhagavan. So, likewise, you will have to think that you are going to put your asan in front of Guru Padma forever. Not going against Guru Padma. But you are going. But you are going against Guru Padma. Your activities, your speeches, your everything, writing, all can prove that you are against Guru Padma. But foolish world cannot discover it. You are clever like crow or jackal. You are clever, but like jackal and crow. Crow ultimately what happened? Crow thing, I am very clever. 
jackal thing, I am very clever. But ultimately, they become cheated. Follow. They are going to get some garbage. Nothing else. Treasure they cannot get. So, evam guru pasanayika bhaktya, this kind of devotional mood, which kind of? The, the, the way I already told you, na? this way we will have to serve Guru Pad Padmo. Evam Guru Pasanika Bhaktya, Vidya Kutare no Sithe no Dhira, Guru Pad Padma giving me the knowledge of Prakita Gyan, and this can be compared with the cutter. I am going to get the cutter and going to cut the tree. I cut which tree? You yourself is a tree. You are, you are in bonded condition. You are in bonded condition in the material world, all tightly bondage. All your desire, Anna Vilas, all going to. So, with this cutter of knowledge, you are going to cut, cut, cut. Cutting the tree is now eradicated. Now you are free. Now you can feel flying in the sky by knowledge and prema of Gauranga Mahaprabhu. Follow this way. So, evam guru pasanaika bhaktya vidya kutare no sithe no dhira, very sharp, very sharp cutter, very sharp, sithe no dhira. Dhir, dhir mane, those who are intelligent in true sense, those who cannot keep any link with Gurudeva and Vaishnava, they are not dhir. Dhira means his mind is settled down. Now he has connection with Guru Vaishnava, he says, Dhira. Dhira, this word I cannot apply everywhere, anywhere and everywhere. This word surely I cannot apply anywhere and everywhere. Only this case. Who has connection with Guru Padmadhu, who can see past and present, what he is doing? Link. He has tight linkage with previous. It's called Dhira. So those who are Dhira, only they can think that way. Taking the carter from Guru Pat Padma can cut the bondage and, the, and can make his bondage free. And after that, Bibrisya Jiva Sayamayam Ashaya. Bibrisya Jiva Sayamayam. Jivas inside this body is in now in tight condition, tight, in bondage condition. Bibrisya Mane by cutting. Bibrisya Mane cutting. Jeev Asayam, Aswaya, many Annavilas, everything there. Bibrishya Jeeva Asayamayam, hmm. From uh, Apramatto, Apramatto many, Apramatto who can be called Apramatto? Pramatto and Apramatto, two words. Bengali and Sanskrit both. Pramatto means those who are crazy, those who are floating in the ocean of Maya, Pramatto. And Apramatta means but very serious. Very serious. Very serious and alert. Alert, very alert. Any small mistake, any small mistake can throw you away from Bhajan. So always alert, cautious. Like in material world, we find those who are playing judo karate. Eh? You see? Very alert. Somebody from backside attacking, they can understand. They are material example, but still they. So very alert. If there is no alertness, they cannot go for that kind of playing. So now you are try to understand if judo karate there is this kind of alertness. Eh? What kind of alertness? Huh? What kind of alertness you need to go guru seva? That's why in Kirtan it is written, na? In Kirtan. Bando mui sabodhano mate. Jaharopo sade bhai e bhavoto riya jai. Krishna prapti hoi jaha hoi te. This Kirtan is there. Already there. Shabdhan must have been alert. There should not be any. Mistake, small mistake, very small mistake can throw you away. Be careful. So, he is saying, Vibhrishya jiva sayam apramatto. 
of an alert guru seva if sevak is not alert he cannot do seva bamangu se my old age inside his room night time like me i used to stay inside guru mahal room night time used to help him to go to bath a same thing have an bamangu se my and sevak is sleep heavy sleeping seva sleeping seva sleeping heavily and vaishnav was the actually very mercy uh, very mercy was said okay sleeping let me go alone he is going alone very slowly is going and in the bathroom sleep and break the rib bamun maharaj simply because of that seva why you are inside gurudev room to sir if you need to sleep why not go outside why this is the lack of alertness maharaj break his rib but in my case i don't know it never happened so though the condition of my guru maharaj was more old age he was not so well maybe 85 or 84 then and my guru maharaj was almost 94 96 even 100 after that 102 so much going to go by catching him so how much alertness we need like a dog from dog we can learn dog is sleeping tap we are learning from god uh, dog dog is sleeping but very quickly can happen dog is satisfied in any amount of food getting okay today one chapati okay right sir this thing <laughs> these are dog what you can learn from dog is a lap for master faithful dog is the top most faithful creature in the world of course i am not going to count guru vishnu surely i'm thinking about <laughs> thinking about material world guru vishnu on god so dog, dog is the top, is the top most faithful creature in the creation of bhagwan so faithful if you love god give something stay with you can never forget Sri Bharati Maharaj used to give one example of our uh, uh, Spain. One uh, example, while I have no time to speak now, only time is there to run. Anyway, I can explain the rest of the part, and I can enter. Evam Guru Pasanayi Ka Bhaktiya Vidya Kutare No Sithi No Dhira Vibrishya Jiva Swayamayam Apramatta Shampaddo Cha Atmanam Atho Tejyo Astam वांछकल्पतरुष्य के बासिंद पतितानंग पावन भविष्य